Thanks. Veterans Day is coming up next week in the city of Colleen. They're preparing for a big celebration. Fox 44's Allison Fox O'Connor joins us in the studio for a look at what Colleen residents can expect on November 11th. Adam M.G., Veterans Day is the day where we celebrate and remember those who served our country. And after canceling the parade last year due to the COVID-19 pandemic, the city of Colleen is ready to get back into the celebrations. Being back with the military is just like being one big family. Guadalupe Lopez spent 26 years in the Army and retired as a Sergeant Major. Now he's the co-chair for the City of Colleen's Veterans Day Parade. The parade was canceled in 2020 due to the COVID-19 pandemic, but this year they are back in action. Uh, in the past, we had had as many as uh, 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 75 vehicles and a uh, like number of uh, walk-in. So our parade sometimes lasted about an hour and a half. But uh, this year, just looking at the registration forms, um, we're very lucky we have about 50 uh, uh, vehicles. The parade will begin at 11 a.m. at West Avenue D next to City Hall, but there will be a presentation from military officials on the steps of City Hall before the parade to honor Colleen and the surrounding cities. And after being away for two years, Lopez says he's most looking forward to. Most of us, uh, like I said, belong to a veteran activity. So once we finish with the parade, we uh, normally go back to our uh, organizations and have barbecues. So if you were in Killeen at that time, you can go to any veteran organization and they will have a barbecue or, you know, things going on in, in each of the uh, uh, places. Co-Chair Lopez also said that if you want to be part of the parade, you can fill out a registration form now, or if it's last minute, you can just join the line of cars at the parade next Thursday. In the studio, I'm Allison Fox O'Connor, Fox 44 News.